Do you know how to identify a rational number? Do you know the properties of rational numbers? Let's take a look. First, a rational number is a number that can be written in fraction form, or we could say in the form a over b, where a and b are integers and b is not equal to zero. There are different forms of these fractions. There's proper fractions, where the numerator is smaller than the denominator, as in one half. There's also improper fractions. And improper fractions is when the numerator is greater than the denominator. And we can also have equivalent fractions. Equivalent meaning equal, where one half in this example is equal to two fourths. We can say these are equivalent fractions. Each of these examples qualifies as a rational number. Let's take a look at an example. Is this a rational number? Yes, it's a rational number because it's in the form a over b. What about 10 over 3? Again, it's a rational number. Now, we said that rational numbers could be written in fraction form. But what about decimals? Are decimals rational numbers? Hmm, that's something to think about. Decimals can be rational numbers as long as they can be written in the form a over b, where a and b are integers and b is not zero. So for example, if I have point 0.33, I can rewrite that as 33 over 100 this 33 over 100 is in the form of a rational number. So we can say that this is a rational number and that this is also a rational number. What about if I have 0 0.07? Again, that could be 7 out of 100. These would both be rational numbers. What about if I have this, negative 1 half? Well, Negative numbers are integers, and b is not zero, so this too is equal to a rational number. If I have negative 0.5, I can say that this is the same as negative 5 tenths. These are also rational numbers. Here's a little chart with some examples of rational numbers. Notice that this whole number 3 can be written as 3 over 1, so it's a rational number. 6 and 73 hundredths can be written as 673 over 100. It could also be written as 6 and 73 hundredths, still a rational number. And 5 and 2 sevenths can be written as an improper fraction, 37 sevenths, also still a rational number. Remember, rational numbers can be written in the form a over b, where a and b are integers, and b is not equal to zero. This is the big rule to remember whenever you're identifying a rational number.